2016 or 17, that's really when I would say the retail sector um, and, and some other parts of the business community started to have a deeper understanding of the climate crisis and the relevance for business, both in terms of climate um, issues as a risk to business, but also the ability for business to make a difference for mitigating uh, emissions and uh, adapting uh, to the crisis. And so um, at Walmart, we uh, became the first retailer to set a science-based target for emissions reduction back in 2016, 2017 timeframe, working with many scientists who um, at the time were sort of portioning out what each industry sector needed to do or how each industry sector could reduce emissions, decarbonize, um, to do its part at that time to stay within the Paris Agreement kind of one and a half to, or two degree warming scenario. So we set a goal. Why, why did we do that? Well, we did our own analysis of what was the risk to retail of climate change. And we found, you know, looking at different scenarios, especially at that time, the business as usual scenario, right? If no action's taken, what are the risks? Well.